welcome to chemistry tutorial 360 today we are going to learn how to balance hot chemical equations right uh, chemical equation that are hard actually to balance however uh, to balance a uh, uh, hot chemical equation will follow just four steps right four steps however uh, to balance uh, this is a chemical reaction which is hard to balance so we'll try to balance and we'll we will try to balance this equation in just four steps right so let's get started uh, in the first steps i have to draw a table like this right and in the second step i have to count the number of atom here we have two iron and here we have three oxygen and here we have one carbon right and here we have one iron and here we have one carbon and here we have two oxygen okay to balance this uh, reaction what I will do okay here we have two iron but here we have one iron so I can balance the iron first, right? Or here we have three oxygen, but here we have two oxygen. So I can balance the oxygen first. Usually we balance os oxygen in the last. But uh, see here, uh, this uh, three is a odd number, right? Uh, so uh, you can uh, make it a uh, even number and that will make it easy to balance this reaction. I will show this in the later. But I will try to balance this reaction, uh, uh, taking uh, into consideration iron first. So to balance the iron, what can I do? I can multiply here simply by 2. That gives me 2. Remember, these two must come before this iron. That is here. So you have to press here coefficient 2, right? So your iron is balanced. But your oxygen is not balanced. So to balance the oxygen, what will it do? You can multiply this oxygen by these two and you can multiply these two by this oxygen. Then you will get a, a 6 which is uh, equal from both sides. So you can multiply here by 2 that gives you 6. Right. So and here you can also multiply by 3 that gives you 6. Right. Remember these two must come before this oxygen that is here and these three must come before this oxygen that is here so i i these two must come before this oxygen that is here so i have to place here two right okay if i place here two the number of iron will be changed so i am getting here two times two that is four right so i have to write here four iron right and and here uh, okay everything is okay but these two these three must come before this uh, this oxygen that is here so i have to place here three if i place here three my number of carbon uh, will be changed so i am getting here three carbon right so i am getting here three carbon right okay uh, now our oxygen is balanced but our iron is not balanced uh, here uh, iron 2 but here 4 so to balance the iron what can I do I can multiply here by 2 that 2 that gives me 4 right and these two remember must come before this iron that is here that is I have to place here 2 2 times 2 that gives me 4 right okay so our iron is balanced now our oxygen is balanced but our carbon is not balanced so to balance the carbon what can i do okay mm, okay here we have three but here we have one so i can just multiply here by three that gives me three and these three must come before this carbon that is here so i have to place here three now you see uh, our iron 4 4 oxygen 6 6 and carbon 3 3 so everything is balanced you can count here 3 carbon 3 carbon 6 oxygen uh, 
6 oxygen, 4 iron, 4 iron. So everything is balanced. So you can uh, say that this is the balanced equation. In the fourth step, you have to change this sign with equal sign. So how? Okay. Like this, right? So this is the balanced reaction. So thank you for viewing this video. Be well.